Hello everyone, time to grind here, and today we are back with some more Boar, Bless uh, Boar Blasters, uh, because this game is uh, really, really, really good. Uh, we've done two episodes of it before, if you haven't seen it, it's a uh, dwarf mining roguelike, uh, and also, what is this ship? What is this ship? What? Well, we're immediately... Okay, we found a ship. Okay, well last episode, right, we tried out this character a lot. The one that has the uh, homing missiles that explode on impact. I'm gonna go ahead and keep playing her because I think I like her more. I don't know what this ship is. There's been a couple of updates adding daily runs and stuff like that. Also, what is this? Wait, we're digging on a ship here? We're on a new intruder alert. Get them, boys. Okay, wait, what? Okay, so if you guys haven't seen this game, obviously we're, we're in a ship, we're a dwarf, we're mining, we're getting upgrades. It's a roguelike, a lot of fun, not hard uh, to, to uh, figure it out. There's some meta progression we've been doing over the last two episodes. So there was a couple of updates that added daily runs, added some more quests to the kind of end game and stuff like that. I don't know if that's what we're in. Either way, we're on a ship. We're mining a ship. I don't know. So what do we want the upgrade of? Bullets explode on impact, but there's a lower fire rate? Sure. Sure, that seems pretty good, especially if there's going to be a lot of enemies and stuff like that. Also, I think we learned... There's all the homing missiles. I think we learned um, that all of the gems end up doing the kind of same amount of stuff. Uh, improve special ability cooldown rate or earn more from gems and blocks. We're going to just fire, fire... Oh, geez, that was scary. We're just going to fire more missiles because all of our missiles are explosive. Uh, so if you also see in the uh, top left, we're trying to make it far down in this area. But I guess there's also all of these enemies. I've never done this type of uh, mission before, so we're gonna have to see how this goes. Uh, and welcome, welcome, uh, SR. Uh, periodically drop autonomous drill module to create a shaft. Uh, yeah, let's do that just so we can, even if I'm fighting, we can still maybe eventually be mining down where we need to. But yeah, now that we've learned any type of gems or experience here, it's, uh, it's pretty good. Ryan, do you play Brotato? I have played a lot of Brotato. We have a whole Let's Play series on our channel. Uh, check out the playlist. There's like 70 or 80 Brotato videos. I made so many Brotato videos. The dev added a item to this Rainbow Monstera Leaf is added into Brotato uh, as a reference to me. So, uh, and that's that's my merch. Uh, total shill time here. Okay, we're gonna fire more bullets per second. But yeah, Brotato's amazing. Uh, there's an update that's supposed to be coming out soon as well, uh, which I'm really, really excited about. So we'll probably be going back because, yeah, we, for those of you guys that don't know, we grinded. That was a really fun series. We played until we beat Danger 5 on every single character, and then we tried out some mods and stuff like that. So if you like Brotato, uh, you are in for a treat with that playlist. Uh, we're going to just keep uh, firing more bullets per second. I think if we're with all of this explosive stuff, that seems pretty good. Uh, we also have a limited... Oh! Limited amount of fuel. Obviously, a limited amount of health as well, but... We're vibing. We're vibing. See, and while I was shooting, we kind of started to get this mine shaft going. It's kind of nice. Uh, we're also getting a lot of upgrades. Gem blocks launch projectiles when destroyed. Let's do that, because there's a lot of gem blocks. Oh my gosh, look at the chain reaction that's happening now because of that, uh, that upgrade. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <clears throat> What's going on, uh, with, uh, the horror short film thing? Have I talked about that much? What have I talked about on this? All I know is there's a totally normal video coming out on the Neon Apes YouTube channel on April 1st. That's all I know. That's all I know. I don't remember talking about more than that. <laughs> all I know is there's a totally normal video on the Neon Apes channel coming out on uh, on April 1st. That's all I know. Also, dude, the chain reaction of these gems is amazing. Amazing, amazing. Fire more bullets per second. 100% what we need. I've never seen the game. It's not la It's lagging a little bit. Just a little bit, but this is definitely one I feel like one of the more broken builds we've ever gotten, but I think it's just because of the quantity of gems on this map here. Um, increase uh, bullet range, special ability cooldown. We'll just say enemies drop gems on death, that way we get a ton of gems. Three characters away from Brotato, uh, Danger 5, it's so hard. Yeah, yeah, it was a grind, but we, we beat Danger 5 on every single character. That was, uh, that was very, very fun. Uh, oh, uh-uh. No, no, no. Dude, the chain reaction of the gem stuff is so broken here. Uh, blocks drop gems. We're gonna go ahead and now increase our damage because we fire so many bullets. 
uh, that I imagine that that would be pretty broken. So uh, we're, we're about half of our fuel, and we're way further down than halfway. So seems like this run is going extremely well. Increased damage, sure. Dude, the chain reaction of the gem blocks has been absolutely insane. We are earning so many gems. We're going to get so much out-of-game currency. Like, just look at this. Just the chain reactions that happen are so good. Far more bullets per second. Can't complain about that. So once we get down... I was going to say, yeah, once we get down to the bottom, we're going to see exactly where we need to go. Happens to be to the right, but I kind of want to. We have plenty of fuel, so I'm going to just kind of mine out... A bunch of money. I mean, this is a ridiculous amount of money. This is an absolute ridiculous amount of money. We still haven't taken any damage either. So I don't know if this was a mission that we were supposed to do earlier. I don't remember seeing a, a dropship anywhere. Um, sure, shoot out of the back as well. We have so many bullets. I don't think it really matters. We've already leveled up so much. Kind of getting all of this money. Probably going to end up with like 250k or something like that. Yeah, that that uh, <laughs> that chain reaction thing. Absolutely broken on this map. And there's the chest that we want to get to. Spend a little bit more time just getting all this money. I still got more fuel. There's more that I can earn. Still leveling up. Increase the damage here. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay. All of this money. Yeah, I think we're going to maybe end up with 300k. I think we get some gems also just by beating the game. But okay, there. Oh, okay. A little bit more rockets. A little bit more fuel. I want to see if I can get up to 300k here. There's just so much money to be had. Oh my gosh. I'm being so greedy. I'm being so greedy, but it's perfect. Oh my gosh. We're now over 300k. It's just, this is such a good build and there's so many gems on this map. I got to exploit it a little bit. Okay. Now we're going to complete the mission here. Um, and uh, yeah, see, see if that progresses the story a little bit more. Obviously, we're going to get some unlocks. Woo! Achievement still 250,000 gold from the goblin treasure ship. Oh, that's what it was. That was a goblin treasure ship. And we just unlocked tuning kit. It's a consumable. Start with basic stat boosts. So maybe that's when we run out of unlocks or something. I want to know what game this is. This is Boar Blasters. It's really, really cool. We filmed two episodes of it before. This is our third episode. It's like a dwarf mining roguelike. Uh, we're going to go ahead and upgrade... Uh, uh, flight time we can't. We can't do the gem. Uh, we're going to go do gem magnet range. That way we can keep earning more. And we're going to go ahead and up our damage. Cool. So that's the kind of permanent progression. So yeah, we have these things in the bottom left. So we have stat boost. So I don't know. A goblin treasure ship uh, it seems to have disappeared. Obviously, there's a vault so we can see what pro progress we are of the game. Um, or with the missions at least. So it seems like we are 62.7% done. Um, and so now we're just going to go to random islands here. Do the mining. Do whatever here. We'll pick this one. Sure. And we just got to go to the end. I'm going to overall... I, I like this. The one we unlocked last time. The one with the homing missiles. It's, uh, it's pretty fun. So okay. Let's go mine. Let's do it. See, so definitely less crystals. It makes some sense now that if we were on a goblin treasure ship stealing all of their money. Kind of at war with the goblins here. That's the that's the lore. Um, so we're going to do this time. We're going to just do improve this special uh, cooldown. Right? So I can use those homing missiles more and more often. Um, that seems pretty, pretty good. Overall, doesn't seem like this map's going to be too hard. Some of the maps are a lot harder than others. I don't know how they really scale. Ooh, some of this is harder to break, though. Um, okay. We're obviously getting way less upgrades than last time. That was a little bit of a teaser. Because that was just a very specific mission. Uh, looks fun. How much does this cost? I think this is a very cheap game. I think it's somewhere between 5 or $10. I don't remember the exact amount. 
but a very solid game. Ooh, okay, I don't think we've ever gotten this. Bullets reflect off blocks and enemies, uh, but we have a lower fire rate. So all of our stuff ricochets now. That's pretty cool. We're going to just keep using these. we got to make our way to the bottom. We're already pretty much there. I imagine we'll be able to kind of like rapid fire a decent bit. Uh, some of the easier um, maps, because I don't know, like, if you go and play some of the, like, easier difficulty maps, if you're on a harder uh, game mode, or, like, if you've gotten more progression, if it scales them up, not really 100% sure. We're going to massively increase fire rate, aiming is for elves. That is perfect with this kind of ricochet build. So we can kind of just use this to destroy whatever. Are you going to play any games in this stream? <laughs> this is a this is a no video game uh, stream. We are uh, we're not allowed to play video games. I'm actually doing a challenge right now, uh, where we're not allowed to play video games. Okay, earn more gems from blocks. See, I'm not. I mean, we earned over three hundred thousand last one. We're at like we're sitting at like thirty five k here. We've already found the ending. I'm just gonna go get a little bit more here since it was right here. I'm not gonna waste my time grinding a map that doesn't have like a ton. Okay. Kill the bats. Get to chest. Girl boss gatekeep gaslight. <sighs> okay. Are we unlocked? The orbital battle axe. Cleaves blocks and foes. Let's go. So we're still getting more unlocks. I don't think we're really going to be able to afford any of the out of game progression. We've done a lot of them already here. Uh, let me go ahead and um, let's see here. Um, okay. Mm okay. Um, let's go ahead here. Oh, yeah, we are starting with just more, uh, for the next two maps now. We're starting with extra stat boosts as well. We're almost there. It's as though I thought the research facility is completely locked down. Oh, I might have to ask an old colleague for some advice here. Hold on. If this is about you losing your fancy wrench at cards last night, so help me, son of... Oh, never mind. I just got the message. Listen, if there's any old drones around, we used to scrape decent data from their command modules. See if there's anything worth finding down there. Okay, so we kind of have like a main objective on this. We got to look through, through for the drones or something like that. What's this game called? This is called a Boar Blasters. B-O-R-E Blasters. If you like this, we got a, we got a playlist with two other videos. Um, this is our third episode here. Okay. Uh, oh, let's try this battle axe. Cleaves, blocks, and flow foes. Let's go. So welcome, welcome, Zai. Um, okay, we might... Oh, there it is. Well, there's whatever that is. What is this? God, encrypted. Keep looking. So that was a drone that was encrypted. We're trying to find a non-encrypted drone, apparently. Something like that. Okay, so this green stuff tends to be a little bit harder. All these, like, there's, like, poison gas things here as well. That, that if I touch, I'll actually take some damage. Okay. Got another drone. I don't know if that was encrypted or not, but he's already telling me to go get another one. Okay, leveled up here again. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and get more of that ricochet. That ricochet perk is really fun. Oh, more fuel. That increases the amount of time we can actually uh, fly. Because if you run out of fuel, you kind of just, like, crash. Okay, found another drone. He keeps just telling me more and more and more drones. That's fine. There's some tre uh, chests over here. But yeah, this game is just one of those that's, like, super satisfying. And, like, super addicting for you to just, like, accidentally play way too long, you know? Uh, we're going to go ahead and say increase damage. That way we can make sure we get to the bottom faster. That's the one. Downloading data. You know, they were a bit thick back then with their security. It's uh, it's a wonder they were smart enough to have the tech advantage in the later half of the war, honestly. Uh-oh, intruders. Whoa. Whoa, what? Oh, dear. Maybe time to head back, pal. Okay, so we qu completed the quest. We do still want to try to make it to the bottom. Um, okay, we're going to just keep increasing damage here. Um, let's do this here. Oh, big chest. Big boy chest. Oh, there's some more fuel here, too. Not, not that we need it. We're already pretty much near the end here. 
Ordered some panda for lunch today, tasty. Hey, I had panda last night for dinner. Panda Express, best fast food restaurant ever. Ever, ever. There's just so many, oh dude, panda. Panda, panda, panda. Panda, panda, panda. Okay, we're nearing the end here. We still got plenty of fuel because we found a lot of fuel pickups here, which is nice. Okay, got an upgrade. Uh, more carnage. Yeah, more axes, baby. Let's get more axes. You can never have enough axes. Uh, you can also never have enough treasure chests here. Yeah, the axes are actually pretty nice because they're protecting me from enemies that, like, try to get close to us, you know? And we're already nearing the end. We're doing pretty good. We haven't had any trouble on any of these maps quite yet. Doesn't mean we're not gonna have trouble here. TTG dreams of being sponsored by Ta Panda. Dude, I would love a Panda Express uh, sponsorship. I know at one point in time, like two years ago, we talked about Panda Express on one of our food episodes of the podcast. And um, I think we made a micro content out of it and they ended up sending us a bunch of like 10% off coupons. Nothing crazy, but it was cool to be recognized by them, you know? Okay. So we did this. We unlocked Gem Synthesis Autonomaton. Gem Generating Drone. There's drones in this game? That's pretty badass. Okay, can't afford anything. That's fine. Uh, ooh, let's go to the ice area. We still, this is our last one of having extra stat boosts at the beginning. Maybe that's why we're doing good, you know. This is it, the heart of the research facility. Strap in, it's gonna get bumpy. What's gonna get bumpy? Listen, we won. Back in the day, I used to tinker with gadgets myself. I've been working on something for the last few decades. Just needed one part I could never get my hands on. During the war, the goblins had some mysterious transformative tech. But it seems this day has finally come where I can look at it myself. Find the transformer matrix for me. Dude, I wonder if we're gonna unlock a new type of ship. New type of ship? Oh god, they got freaking sentries. Oh, they're shooting sentries at us now. This this seems like it's our first hard mission. This seems like it's our first hard mission for sure. Bunch of turrets. Okay. Um, launch electric orbs to clear a path. Sure, let's do that. I'm gonna launch some Tesla orbs. I don't I remember it being a little bit not consistent, but that's okay. That's okay. Oh, dude, I'm getting, like, actually cold. I guess you... Wow, dude. Your ship kind of, like, slows down. I don't know if it is, like, ice blocks that come around or if just by naturally being down here. Oh, that's what it is. Yeah, I destroyed some block and it shot a bunch of, uh, like, ice shards at me. And I guess if you get hit by them, you get slowed a little bit. Which is, uh, you know what? That's valid. It's, it's cold down here. It's cold. Yeah, see you in a bit, uh, later, uh, Zai. Good luck with the, uh, driving, uh, teaching. Get out of here, bat. I gotta mine! I gotta find the transformative whatever. Whatever the thing that the guy wanted. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and, uh, bullets explode on impact. I like that one a lot. So what is that? Oh! I somehow didn't take damage from whatever that was. It seemed like I should have, but I didn't, so... Once again, girl boss, gatekeep, gaslight. Give me dumb gems, give me dumb gems. We're kind of just speedrunning down here. A couple turrets, though. Yeah, I don't really know how good these Tesla things are. It's hard to tell how well this one's actually helping us. Uh, uh, more bullets per second because our bullets explode. It's a good old classic combo. Obviously, the more we play, the more kind of build diversity we're going to have. Like, because we're going to keep getting more and more of those unlocks. Okay, so yep, those were those ice shards. But I think you can shoot the ice shards out. Oh, we still got slowed. Oh, we got slowed and then something bashed into us here. Oh, what the? There was a sword enemy? What was that? What was that? Dude, we're like playing Terraria now. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm actually starting to take some- Oh my- Oh my god, I'm taking damage. What is happening? 
There's freaking swords attacking us. Okay, what? We just need to make it down there. We're less than half fuel. A lot of enemies. I want the thing where I can shoot in, uh, behind me. Oh, that's a big chest over there. That's a big chest over there. Give me that big chest. Give me that big chest. Okay, another level up. Launch explosive projectiles at a distance. Sure. Anything to help help out. Okay, I feel we're 75% mined. Oh, dude, those swords move super fast. I think these generators are just decoration. I think. I think I think. Okay, okay. Mine, mine. Go down, go down. Dude, we're almost there. We still got a decent amount of fuel. Oh, but I only have 2 HP, though. I only have 2 HP. Be a little bit careful. Okay. Nice, nice. Okay, this is whatever the guy wanted. That's it. Let's get back to the ship. It's finally time for me to get back in the gyrocopter seat. Yo, we unlocked a new character. I wonder if he's going to be a drone character. So now we're going to just see if we can make it to the bottom. So many enemies right now. Oh my gosh. I am fighting for my life right now. Okay, okay. We just got to go to the right here. Oh, I have one HP. I have one HP. I have one HP. Oh my God. Okay. Oh my God. We're almost there. We're almost there. One HP though. One HP. And there's drones shooting at me still. Oh my God. Big, big, big enemy. Big enemy. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. I have one HP, dude. I have one HP. Just get me there. Just get me there. Oh, we did it. We did it. We did it. We did it. Two HP in a dream. I guess, yeah, at the end it was one HP in a dream, but yeah. <laughs> we have done did it. 108,000. We unlocked overdrive thrusters. Increased copter speed 20%. Increased fuel consumption. Oh, so we go faster, but we consume more fuel. That's interesting. Um, okay, we're going to go ahead and give ourselves a little bit more health. Sure. And we unlocked a new character. That's pretty cool. Let's go here. What does this new character do? Gemforge Ray. Shoot a ray that converts blocks into brittle clusters of gems? Yo, so it's going to be harder to mine, but... Um, we're going to get more upgrades though and money. So almost time to move back up. But first we'll do a quick sweep of the off. We'll do a quick sweep of the ground. Any information about the goblin leader's whereabouts would give us a big advantage. So we got a third ship here now. A third ship, a little bit more health here. Um, okay. Uh, we're going to fire more bullets per second. Okay, so what does this do? Oh my gosh! That's pretty cool! Because I guess it does still help you mine a little bit, because if you do that to something that's harder to mine, um, then uh, it'll be pretty good. Like, watch. Boom! And now I can just super easily mine all of this and get a bunch of upgrades. That's amazing. I don't know if I want that new upgrade, though. I'll go ahead and get shoot out of the back. It's a really good one. This is a spooky area. Oh, this is the one with bugs. This is the one with bugs. Yeah, I'm very, very glad we got the thing where we shoot behind us. Though, to be honest, it might make us spawn more of these guys. But at the very least, it means I can dig while also shooting behind me. We're also going to then get Ricochet. So I might accidentally be destroying a lot of the uh, nest blocks. But we should be able to handle it. And just keep turning things into these crystals. Dude, you get so much more levels. You get so much more levels with these characters. Uh, we're going to say blocks drop gems. Wow, dude. This is a cool, cool character here. Absolutely cool character. A lot of bugs. A lot of bugs. A lot of bugs. That's fine. Dude, I love this character. Every character, I feel like it's like my favorite thing now. Oh my gosh. Okay, uh, increased bullet range, sure. It's got all the ricochet stuff, so bullet range actually seems like super, super cool. 
Can you sell them? Uh, the gems? If you're talking about the gems, they by default give us money up there. They give us money and experience. So the money we use for the out of game progression to make our ship better. And obviously the experience gives us these upgrades right now. Blocks drop more gems. Let's go. We're going to just uh, really do a build like that. Since we're turning a lot of blocks into gems, we're destroying a lot of blocks. Just like, boom, dude. And then all those blocks are worth so many gems. We're getting so many level ups. We're mining super, super, super good, too. Um, improve special ability cooldown rate. Sure. That's more That's more currency. That's like the best thing. So we're still doing good on our uh, health situation. Uh, we got two. Or, uh, well, yeah, health. and But I meant fuel. But there's one fuel. Here's another fuel. And we get whatever this main objective was. Commencing data drive recording playback. Look at these specimens, ferocious, bloodthirsty even. If we can set up a network and use this transmorgification tech, I reckon the dwarves will have their work cut out for them. See to it that you get it done and use as many prisoners as you need. We have a war to win, boys. Hmm. Don't like that at all. It's merits f it merits... It merits further investigation, though. That's for sure. Let's... Arg, what are those? What, the swords? Uh, gem blocks, launch projectiles when destroyed. That's pretty good with this type of build. Okay, so was that implied that the goblins are taking prisoners and turning them into, like, these guys or something? Also, the, uh, the thing where gems ricochet is so good. So good. It's so satisfying. Okay, gem, uh, generating drone. We have a drone that just gen generates gems, I guess. That was one of the unlocks here. <laughs> this is super, super cool. Yo, yo. Oh, man. A lot of guys are sending at us. We're doing fine on fuel, though. Doing just fine on the fuel. Our build is really good for clearing out these bugs. Oh, we took some damage there somewhere. Well, that's okay. Oh, gem gen. Oh, no. We'll do blocks generate more gems. That's cool. You can get even more of those. Okay. Oh, dude. It's also, yeah, super good at, um, oh my god, dude. Yeah, this, this might be one of my favorite new classes because it just lets you get more of the level ups, right? And that's super, super cool. Why was the last stream not saved? Uh, so we're, we're doing a new experiment. Um, I, I'm trying super, super hard to go full-time content creation this year. Uh, and so I'm doing a lot of different experimenting, talking with a lot of other content creators, and uh, I kind of was experimenting with leaving the live streams up, uh, and now we're kind of experimenting with kind of keeping those hidden. Um, we are making them members only, so if you want access to the VODs on YouTube, um, you can just become a member. We even made a cheaper tier, um, specifically just that has the vlog access and the stream access and the VODs and stuff like that. Uh, just because I think sometimes it hurts series and it makes it hard for me to know what series people actually like. Like this as an example, right? I don't know if the video is doing bad because people don't want to see more of it or because people already saw it on the stream, you know? Um, so kind of just trying a bunch of different things to go full time. Um, but they are technically, I'm still going to try to make them there, just members only. So yeah, that's, uh, that's the kind of, you know, you guys know, I love being transparent and stuff. So that's kind of why. Can you hear me? If you're still airborne, it's time to return. We have much to discuss. See, they always talk about returning, but I think they normally mean make it like the exact opposite. Like go back down to the bottom to find the chest. Because you don't complete the map unless you go uh, to the chest and do that. So, uh, increase bullet range. His bullet range with all of this uh, ricochet seems pretty good. Dude, oh my gosh. We're going to This is another one we're really, really good. I'm always watching it on the on the uh, the stream VODs. Yeah. And I know that there's a lot of people that do that. Um, it just it really makes it hard. Like, I think it, it hurts like the videos and the algorithm, right? Like, so it, it, a couple different reasons, I think, from talking with other content creators, like Alexa, like he does that. I got the idea from Alexa of making the VODs be for members only, um, because my popular videos like Crab Champions, they'll still get a lot of views, but like, what if they could get a little bit more views and that would like blow it up snowball, right? And then the small series, they seem like they're doing really bad, but like Spiritfall is an example. Everybody was clicking the streams to watch Spiritfall. So I definitely understand from y'all's perspective, but to be fair, the videos themselves are way higher quality, right? I edit the audio on them and stuff like that. They're neatly in the playlists. Um, so I totally get that, but if you're someone that still still wants that, 
Uh, we did we did add a cheaper uh, YouTube tier. So also for everyone watching on YouTube, uh, perfect shell opportunity. Uh, we'll go ahead and get um, the little uh, axes around us, just protecting us from the enemies. I think. I think that'll help us. Oh jeez. Oh man, dude, those swords. I need more axes to protect me against the swords. And we're nearing the the bottom here. Dude, I love the gem ricochet one. Oh, dude. Yeah, we're starting to unlock some really, really cool stuff. I watched the crab champions part. <laughs> See, exactly. Exactly. Not gonna lie, Brotato was my most favorite series. I know. Well, you're gonna be happy because Brotato, there's gonna be a big announcement, I think, in 10 or 11 days of like a new Brotato update or something like that. So. When a new Brotato update comes out, we're going to be, uh, you know, playing it until we grind out Danger 5 on every new character or whatever. So you can bet your ass we're going to be playing that game some more. You can bet we're going to be doing that. Oh my gosh, dude. Yeah, we're going to earn about 300k again here. Let's go. Dude, this ship is super good. Dude, and all these upgrades we're getting of just getting, like, earning so many gems. Uh, we unlocked the Reverborazer Bouncing Buzzsaw Drone. Dude, we're getting all these drones. So what percent complete are we now? We're 65% complete. Ah, good, you're here. Cogsworth will brief you on your next assignment. I've been studying those creatures down there. Seems like they're a victim of some... And a goblin transformation tech. They emit a faint energy sign signature. We've tracked that same signal to a strong source deep underground. I believe we can use that signal to locate the goblin leader. Once we get to the goblin leader, we destroy him and the goblin transformation tech. No one should have the power to alter, to alter sentient life like that. I appreciate your concern, but I have not decided what will be done with it yet. For all we know, it could be of great use to us in rebuilding what was taken, and I will not make rash decisions before seeing the full picture. Right, my lord. To be perfectly candid, I think a lot of us would rather see it destroyed than be used again as a weapon. Duly noted. You're all dismissed. So it's like the king dwarf, and it almost sounds like he's wanting whatever this crazy weapon for himself. So, that's pretty cool. Magicraft had an update. I don't know, that's still one of those games I want to check out at some point in time. Okay, yeah, we're definitely playing as this gem guy, dude. This gem guy's really cool. Trail's running cold. I thought this might happen. The signal's too weak. Plant this signal booster down in, lo in the location I've marked. It should better penetrate the bedrock so we can find where they're hiding. Isn't there an Easter event update in Brotato? Maybe for Brotato Mobile. I mean, Brotato Mobile's kind of handled by a different company. So I could see maybe they added some... You know, random event. Oh, that actually messed up because I broke the chain reaction. Okay, we're going to get a bunch of these axes here. But yeah, as far as like normal, legitimate... Not le not that Rotato Mobile is not legitimate, but a little bit of a different game. Um, depending on which version you're playing. Um, okay, Bouncing Buzzsaw Drone. Drones. That doesn't seem too great, <laughs> to be honest. But maybe as we upgrade him, I don't know. The drone right now doesn't seem too good. <laughs> but I love this character just because we end up leveling up so much. Okay, we're going to just get more axes. Uh, we're in the fire area, so there's going to be some fire being shot at us. This is actually, this might be a hard mission here, uh, to be honest, because um, kind of, we got to go deep on this mission. Uh, sure, more axes. I want to see... How many axes I can get? I don't know if the axes can stop projectiles, too. I hope they can. I hope they can. Oh, my gosh. This gem? <laughs> this class is super cool. Okay, so we make it here to the part that's super hard to mine. And then we just go, boo! It's not hard to mine because it's just gems that get us to level up. Um, I don't know how many enemies there's going to be. I'm going to just increase damage here. I guess because I'm on mobile, so yeah, there is. I don't really know if it's the same as PC. Yeah, there's like two different versions of Brotato. I know like the free one is like 
all about um, like you don't have access to all the characters at first and like there's like a currency to unlock the characters and stuff like that um, I haven't actually played Brotato Mobile and then I think there's a version of Brotato Mobile that's like the full PC version or something so uh, I don't know. I'm curious in that Brotato Mobile Easter event, was it like a new character or was it just like, oh, login bonus to earn characters more? Because I could, I could kind of see it being something like that. Also, my hair. My hair. My hair. Whatever, increased damage. But there will be a giant update, apparently. I have no idea what it's going to contain, but uh, for the like PC version. Oh, I forgot the- yeah, there's those enemies that, like, deflate or something like that. Pretty cool. Okay. Dude, I, <laughs> I love this class so much. What is this? Uh, we'll just say, uh, blocks, drop gems, whatever. Get some more currency here. What is that? We put down a satellite? Great, it's working, but it looks like it's attracting some wildlife. Stick close to it and make sure it's finished calibrating before moving on. Oh, God. I have to stay here? Wonder how I'll know it's done. More of them! Keep close! Protect the signal booster! I'm trying! I'm trying! Almost there! Keep the perimeter clear! I'm trying! I got the axes! This is cool. I like that there's like different missions. Just a little longer. Why don't you just tell me when we're done protecting? You don't need to you don't need to stop the action to keep telling me that we're almost there. Almost. Okay, my man, just tell me when it's ready. That's all I really care about. That's all I really care about. We've got a lock. Head on back. We've got a goblin to kill. So there's the quest. Well, they always say, once again, head on back, when in reality it's just go back to the bottom. I want to get this fuel. There we go. All these gems that I spawned while we were fighting, I want to get them here. Yeah, you need to pay, like, coins for characters, and the monsters just have some Easter Bunny cosmetic thing. Gotcha. Um, fire more bullets per second. That'll help out in a variety of ways here. Um, the thing is, is, I don't know... <sighs> I want to get all of this currency, but I don't know if we're going to have enough fuel. This is going to be the first time I don't know if we have enough fuel. Because I'm looking at how deep we are. And obviously that's because I was kind of doing this protection mission, whatever this was. Okay, okay. We're mining down. We've turned them into gems here. Okay. Um, fire more bullets per second. I'm trying to get to the bottom here. I'm trying to get down to the bottom. Just got here, what's this game about? Yeah, this is Boar Blasters. It's a dwarf mining roguelike. We gotta mine all the way down to the bottom. We get upgrades and we get gems for more upgrades and out of game progression. And there's kind of a story. You unlock different characters. It's just a very fun game. So right now we just completed a mission and we're trying to, we're kind of running out of fuel. It's kind of the problem. Fuel's in top left, but we're trying to make it to the bottom so we can technically complete this map. A lot of enemies coming at me here as well. There's a chain reaction thing right here. Okay, we got an upgrade here. Okay, let's level up bouncing buzz drones. So now I guess we have multiple. Our uh, super turns uh, whatever we're looking at into a very easily destructible gem kind of thing. We're getting close to empty fuel, but we're kind of nearing the bottom. So there's just a lot of enemies. This is really hard. I only have four HP. I don't know if we're going to be able to make it. I'm trying though. A lot of these blocks are also spawning these weird, uh, like, bug things. But, uh, our axes and drones are, uh, hopefully helping out here. Once we get far enough down, it'll kind of tell us the direction we need to go. We're just about to run out of fuel. I really don't know if we're going to be able to do this. We have three health here. Oh my god, dude. We're running out of fuel. We're run Okay, okay, we need to go to the left. We're gonna buy this game. It's on Steam. It's like a cheap game. It's like five or ten dollars. It's really, really good. Okay, detonating bullets. We just need to make it to the left. We're almost there. We're almost there. We're almost there. We're running out of fuel. 
But we're almost there. Please. Please, we're almost there. I don't want to have to replay this map. Oh my god, we're almost there. We're almost there. We're almost there. We're almost there. <gasps> Let's go. We did it. We did it. We did it. Barely again, dude. These have been close. Woo! Close, close, close. Unlock blast wave shrapnel. Explos explosions launch projectiles. That's pretty cool. Um, let's see. Um, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and upgrade. I'm going to wait until I can get earned more from gems so we can max that out. Uh, let's go to another ice area. Sure, why not? Uh, definitely playing as this gem character. This gem Hmm, seems we've reached the end of the trail. We, we must be here? No way. No way you're telling me the goblin leader's here. No way. Already got a chest. Yo. Yo. Okay, um. We're gonna say blocks drop gems, whatever. We're early on. There's a hut. I killed a goblin hut. Did you see the new South Park game as a roguelike? I didn't know it was a roguelike. I've seen like videos and images of it and it doesn't look that good to be totally honest, but I didn't know it was a roguelike. <laughs> that is interesting. Um, okay, there's some fuel over here. There's all of these goblin huts. I don't know if I'm supposed to have a secondary to kill them or if I'm just kind of doing genocide. I don't really know. So I'm just gonna make my way down. Uh, there's more fuel to the left. Um. Yeah, we'll do more drone. We'll do a drone, the gem generating drone. Just kind of giving us gems every now and then. What's not to love about that? Is this game really challenging? Uh, it can be for sure. I don't think it's the most challenging game ever. To be honest, it's kind of more of a chill game. But I mean, as you just saw, like we had a kind of an intense moment there. So uh, we'll get um, just shoot more. Uh, they also, yeah, added, like, a daily challenge and stuff. It's just a very fun game to play. Sometimes it's all you can ask for. Just fun games to play, you know? It's a very fun game. Uh, okay, explosions launch projectiles. I'm gonna take that because it's new. So, and then we're gonna, I guess, try to take anything that we can that launches projectiles here. Another treasure chest. Let's go. Goblin City, but there's no one here. I don't like it. Um, we're going to go ahead and shoot out the back. That's just, like, really good. I really like that. Because if there's enemies following you, you can still mine straight down while defending behind you. We got some spiders. Some spider widers. So I'm just destroying these goblins' homes, but apparently there are no, there's no one home. So it's not fully genocide. I'm sure it's maybe a different war crime, but uh, you know, we never know. Uh, sure, more drones here. Yeah, see ya, man. Appreciate you being here for a bit. This is a very satisfying game, not gonna lie. Yeah, very, very satisfying. I feel like most mining roguelikes or mining, anything with mining, you gotta make the mining satisfying, you know? But yeah, I agree. This is a very, very satisfying game. Love this guy's ability to just turn any blocks into the gem blocks. Um, earn more from gems and blocks. Sure. That seems pretty good when we have a gem drone. So... I want to get this chain reaction thing. Is it 11.57? Where are you from? <laughs> it is 6.12 for me. Okay. Okay. We're almost halfway there. Uh, yes. More drones. Because we also get more from gems. So now we have two drones just giving us gems, dude. Oh, this is... These are some of the most satisfying builds I think we've gotten. Uh, in our in our playthrough so far, oh my god! And then like this block, this these blocks are so hard to break. Not for me though, because I turn them into gems, baby. 
Got some spiders here. We're going to turn it into gems again. Just lets you... Oh, God. It's so satisfying. We're leveling up so much. Uh, drones. Bouncing buzzsaw drone. Okay. Treasure chest over here. Sure. Sure, sure, sure. Treasure chests have a lot of gems. Especially, like I said, when we have that perk where we're getting more money from gems and stuff. Bada bing, bada boom. Level up here again. Earn more from gems and blocks. I'm going to take that. So we have these gem drones. But it's almost like the equivalent of taking like XP gain in like a roguelike. Except for the fact that this also helps us with the out of game currency as well. Because gems are both out of game currency and... Um, kind of the experience points or whatever, so. I'm interested about the lore of these swords, though. That's, that's something I'm slightly interested in. Are they turning people into swords? Is that part of the experiments? What's, what's, what's going on here? What's going on? We're doing okay on fuel. Oh, that was dumb. Okay, I kind of, ex I don't know why I expected anything else. I turned the fuel into gems. Which, uh, spoiler a lot, is not what I necessarily wanted to happen there. <laughs> Another level up. Gem generating drone. This is so good. I just have three gem generating drones following me. And this is what I was talking about. I love being able to mine down and also still be shooting up. What time is it for For me? For me, I, like I was saying, it was 6.15. Not, not late at all for me. Give me them gems. Give me them gems. Give me them gems. Give me them juicy gems. Oh, we took a hit. Whatever shall I do? I don't really do much damage, though, because I've been focusing on all these things just giving me gems, but that's fine. Uh, enemies drop gems on death. Anything to give me more gems. We are kind of running out of fuel, though. So, I mean, we've earned a lot of gems this mission. Uh, I don't know if we're going to be able to make it to the bottom, though. To be completely... Okay, there's some more fuel over here, though. More fuel over here. A little bit more fuel. Go a long way. Oh, okay, come on. We just got to keep going down. I need to haul ass right now. Oh, man. Sword's hitting me. All right, lads. Start the show. Rain down hellfire on him. Starting with the cute one. Who, me? No, obviously I'm referring to the one with the with the wee one with the mustache. That hardly narrows it down. Wait, it was an ambush? They've unleashed an acid tidal wave. Get out of there. They've left behind some of the villagers. We have to save them? Cogsworth, I won't have our troops killed saving them. There would be no honor in leaving them behind. We can make it very well, but be careful. Wait, what? What? This has never happened before. We got to go up? I don't know if I'm going to have the fuel for that, though. I don't think I'm going to have the fuel for that. To go all the way back up? I didn't sign up for this shit. We're going to run out of fuel. We're going to run out of fuel. This does kind of look like Terraria. <laughs> oh, God, dude. Oh, no. Guys, I don't... I, we don't have enough fuel. This isn't not going to happen. Throw bombs out every now and then, whatever. This is... Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God, dude. It was a trap. It was a trap. And I'm going to fall for it. Oh, God. 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 Oh, dude. I'm also just about to run out of fuel. Oh, my God. Oh, we're about to run out of fuel. It's about to be over. Okay, we rescued someone. That's, I don't know. That's not going to be enough. I'm about to run out of fuel. I'm about to run out of fuel. <coughs> not like this. Not like this. No. Not my fuel. <laughs> Our first loss. Ah, uh, this is Boar Blasters, a very fun dwarf mining roguelike. Okay. 
Well, now we can... We've now maxed out... I want to max out the money. So we've maxed out our uh, money capacity. I want to do flight time, but that's really expensive too. Uh, we'll just go ahead and do bullets fired per second. Yeah. Okay. Let's try this mission here again. We're going to play the gem person though. Hmm, seems we've reached the end. Okay. So I believe I completed the mission. I want I don't know if we're going to have to do the the one thing again. Where we defend that one thing. Also, here's some even more fuel. Picking up some fuel early on here. We go a long way. We just know that the, yeah, this is we need a lot of fuel for this. So we're going to uh, copter speed but fuel consumption. Okay, you know what? I'll actually take that. We're using more fuel, but we're faster. Maybe I should have waited on that, because normally we don't need speed going down, but we do want it going up. So I don't know. Maybe that's something we should have waited. I probably won't upgrade it anymore, but I wanted to try taking it at least one time. The bouncing buzz saws aren't the best. I'm going to say increased damage here. Uh, there's some more fuel. We're still at full. Just turn that person's house into a gems. There is a, a treasure chest to the right, but I just need to make my way down. Gem blocks launch projectiles when destroyed. We've learned the power of that one, especially with this character here. Oh, it just helps me. Oh, man. Yeah, helps me clear those areas so fast. Um, okay, uh, we'll get detonate bullets here. The thing helping us mine might have been helpful, but it won't help us when we're going back up. I'm trying to focus on things that are going to help us both go up and down. It's kind of my goal. Goblin City, no one's here. Stay alert. So we know it's a trap because we technically already lost, but they don't know it's a trap. Yeah, we just instantly clear those gem things now because all that projectile stuff. Uh, we're going to say increase damage. Just anything that can help us both ways going up and down. A chain reaction here. Turn everything into gems. Okay. I love the way this area looks. Like, I, I feel like we've been playing this game for 15 minutes, but apparently we've already almost been playing it for 55. Like, this game's just one of those games you just lose your time to, I think. Uh, we're definitely going to get shoot out the back. One of my favorite. This game is just a roguelike you just lose time to, in my opinion. I want to, before we end this video, complete this mission, though. Um, more damage. It's been a lot of damage, hopefully. A lot of good clearing. Uh, we're about halfway, and we're not halfway down there. I don't know. This seems like a very hard mission. But I'm determined. I am determined. Let's slow it a little bit. That's okay. Uh, I should have waited a little bit longer. Uh, fire more bullets per second. That goes a long way when we have, like I said, explodey and extra damage. Uh, I should have waited. My uh, ult. Very good here. There we go. That's just so satisfying, especially with the gem ricochet stuff. That's so good. So, I don't think I'm going to have to... I hope I... if I, As long as I don't have to do that uh, thing where I stand by for a second, then I think we'll be good. But we may have to do that again. I don't know. Um, we'll go ahead and get those battle axes. Help us if we have to do the defending thing. 7.20 a.m. for you. <laughs> yeah, time zones be wild. Time zones be wild. Okay. Back to the hard area here. Yeah, I, I really hope we're not going to have to do the, the the beacon. Beacon almost reminds me of Helldivers 2. I've been playing a lot of Helldivers 2 offline. Or uh, by offline, I mean just 
not like recording and playing it out with my friends. We did one video on it though. Uh, more damage. His damage is always going to be nice, uh, especially with fire rate, because it's good at killing the enemies, good at clearing the blocks. Okay, there's a little bit more fuel. We really need more fuel. Here's one. Helped a little bit. Not a ton, though. Not a ton. All right, lads, start showing them. Do the thing. And he's flirting with the guy with the beard. Okay, so we need to go up. We need to go up. We need to get out of here. And we got to save the villagers, though our king doesn't want us to, but this guy does want us to. Okay, okay, we got to make it back up. We got way more fuel than we did last time. So, I, yeah, we didn't have to do whatever beacon thing, which was very nice. But we do have to go save these people here. And we do, we're a little bit faster. So that's nice. Got our special ability ready. If we need it. Hopefully we'll have enough, uh... Have enough, uh, fuel for this. Going a little bit faster from that one upgrade. 20% faster, but we use 10% uh, more fuel. So overall, for a situation like this, it's perfect. Gonna dig over here. Can definitely do that. Uh, far more bullets per second. Oh my god. No! No, 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 no! We kinda got trapped! We kinda got trapped saving that guy, dude! What? Okay. Oh, oh, oh god. Okay, we ulted. Oh my god, get me out of here. Get me out of here! Get me out of here! Oh god, I got slowed. Oh god, dude. Oh god. Oh my god, go, 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 go. We got a little bit more fuel. A little bit more fuel. A little bit more fuel. Dude, this is intense. This is intense. This is intense. Oh god, we got slowed. Oh, getting slowed sucks. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. We got slowed again. Shit. Shit! Shit! Okay. Mine this part super easily. Whoo, jeez! Okay, more damage. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. How do they get this much acid? How are they flooding an entire ecosystem with acid? How does that work? How does that work, damn it? I gotta get out of here. I gotta get out of here. Dude, we have a- Oh my god, no! No, my fuel! We're out of fuel! We're running out of fuel! Oh god, guys. We're not gonna make it. We're not gonna make it. We're not gonna make it! <laughs> my fuel! My fuel! Oh. I think we'll be able to upgrade our fuel, though. Let's see. Can we upgrade our fuel and then try this again? Jeez, flight time is 693,000. Um, okay, ability cooldown speed might help us. We'll do that. Okay. We're going to try this here again. We're trying it again. We know what must be done. We're so, I mean, sometimes it's challenging. Definitely sometimes challenging. I just need to haul ass. That's what I need to do. I need to stop caring about as many gems. We're going to be getting gems slowly but surely. Chain reaction there. Okay. There we go. I just need to make my way down as fast as I possibly can. So increase damage. Sure, sure. We didn't see any fuel. Last time coming back down, we found some fuel. Okay, nice, nice, nice. There's some fuel. A little bit more fuel. Really hope we can get the uh, the ch uh, chain reaction when you break uh, crystals. Okay, overdrive thrusters. You know what? I'll go ahead and take that. Maybe we take a bunch of that. Because going fast up is really useful. 
We had one of that last time. I don't know if it's kind of like wasting our fuel on the way down. You know, I don't, I don't know if it's inherently the best strat, but we're trying. Um, okay, you know what? We're going to go ahead and get depth charges, so we're going to slowly be mining down. Maybe that'll help us on the, uh, the mining down part. Oh, accidentally touched the wall, which hurts you. Okay, yep, yep, yep. I've already heard y'all talk. I've already heard y'all talk. I'm gonna get more depth charges here. Oh no, the depth, depth charges explode now. That's really cool. That's really cool. I do think this is actually gonna help me mine a lot faster. It's not gonna help me like at all when we come back up. But if I can just get down there faster, that's a big ass explosion. <sighs> uh, explodey bullets, sure. Okay. Oh man, dude, this is just a hard mission. Which, like, you know, I could go do the easier missions, but I'm determined to make this one work here. I have not seen any more fuel. Sure, random explosions. I don't know how much that's... Oh, we found, I think, one fuel so far on this map. Nothing crazy, though. Yeah, those big explosions definitely help out. Hopefully, these explosions just overall make it, like, easier for us to mine back up. Perfect timing here. Um, okay, chain gun activator. This will be pretty good here. Got some stretches we got to do here in a second. Okay. Mine, 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 mine. Okay, big chest. Definitely worth it there. Okay, trying to go fast. Oh, man. Um, what is just more bombs? Additional rounds of that bomb? Seems like it'd be the good, good idea. Seems like it could be a decent idea. Hey, there's some more fuel. Love that. Fuel is very much needed right now. Oh, God, dude. It's clouds, man. Okay, after this blows up. Oh, dang. Okay. There's a chest over there to the right. It is definitely not worth trying to get, though. Sorry I'm late sorting out videos. Yeah, never apologize. Don't ever apologize being late here. I'm just here vibing playing video games if you guys want to watch and vibe. Uh, I'm just I'm just here for when you guys want. So we upload the videos too. You can, you can watch me on your own time. Okay, get out of here, spiders. I got a trap to fall into. I have a trap I need to fall into. Oh, was I getting like... Oh, I think I was just getting slowed. Big old chest. That's a big old chest. That's a fat, big old chest, dude. What? That took so long for me to break open. Gem. I would love the gem generating drone, but... I need things that are going to just get me down here. Okay, there we go. There we go. Okay. Okay, we're, we're going up here now. Okay. Here we go. Okay, ass of tidal wave. Got to make it out. And then this is us talking about whether we're going to save uh, the villagers or whatever. Okay, go, 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 go. We're going a little bit faster. It's like, I'd love to try to get more level ups. Like, I'm trying to get the gems if I can. I did stretch. Stretchy stretched. Okay, okay. A couple more gems here. That's the thing. I don't know if we're gonna ever going to get another level up here. I'm just going to hold on to my uh, ult for times like that. Ah, oh, I could have done that so much better and hit all of that other side of the wall for some more gems, but whatever. Okay. Um, I think we're doing okay on fuel. There's one guy we got to save. 
Doing this for some more gems here. It's a good amount of gems. Still pretty far away from... Uh, whatever it's called. I just need to dodge those icicles a lot better. Come on. Oh god, dude. This material... It's taking too long to mine! Oh god, and I got slowed. Oh god, and I got slowed. Okay, save the other guy. This is getting absolutely terrifying. Okay, improve special ability cooldown. So we can maybe get our ult a little bit faster. Nice! Found some more fuel. That's what we needed. That's what we needed. We're almost back to the surface. We're almost back to the surface. Oh, we're almost there. Oh, we're almost there, y'all. Oh, we're almost there. Oh, shit, I got slowed. Maybe I need to stop mining. I'm not going to mine unless I have to. Oh, my God, we're almost there. We're almost there, though. My fuel's almost out, though, too. Oh, God, guys. I'm trying. Oh my god, almost there, but my fuel! My fuel! Quest completed, where do I go? Where do I go? I'm out of fuel. Looks like the acid is subsiding. Phew, that was a close one. What, do I still need to make go to the bottom? Where do I go? The quest is complete, at least. <sighs> the quest is complete, so we lose, but I think we'll be fine. We might have to redo this map, but the mission's done, so we should just be able to go down. You're being paid to mine, not laser around. <laughs> okay, so, A420. Hey, uh, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and save up for flight time, to be honest. Okay, so let's redo this mission again, because we've completed the mission, so we should be able to go down to the bottom now. As a final run here. Welcome, welcome, everyone popping in here. We're playing some dwarf mining games right now. Gotta make it to the bottom here. We just completed a bunch of really hard objectives on this map, so. Uh, gem blocks launch projectiles when destroyed. That's what I love to see. Especially with this character. Oh, that's so satisfying. Go ahead and get these chain reaction blocks. And you just turn everything into the gems. Um, gem generating drone, sure. Let's get a... I don't think it should be too hard for me to just make it down to the bottom. Um, enemies explode on death, sure. We'll try that out. We'll try that out, I suppose. I suppose. Oh, that's so satisfying. Gem generating drone. <laughs> I love these drones. <laughs> I love these drones. These are some super fun gem and like drone builds. Um, explosions launch projectiles. I don't think we have any explosions right now, but we can get eventually. We will eventually get that. Let's go. Fantasy worlds must be a nightmare to navigate. Imagine going on vacation. To another country during your flight, Gargadesh the Ancient comes out and tries to your plane. Yeah, I think most people are probably just dead in fantasy worlds. Fantasy worlds do not seem fun to live in. Okay, kind of a waste of my stuff there, whatever. You just level up so much with this character. Gem generating drone. <laughs> I have four drones just giving me a constant supply of gems. That is so freaking satisfying. So satisfying. Let's go. Dude, this chain reaction stuff. So satisfying. Okay, periodically throw bombs out. 
So those bombs are going to shoot projectiles as well. So effectively just kind of makes it like a slightly bigger explosion radius, I guess. Doesn't seem that that great. Doesn't seem that good. That's okay, though. All we got to do is make it to the bottom here. Uh, more bombs, more bombs, more projectiles, sure. Okay, get me out of here. This game is just so much fun. Okay, we haven't seen any fuel though, but I don't think we're going to hopefully need it as bad. Um, yeah, shoot out the back. Love that. Love me some back shots. Love me some back shots. Okay. Get out of here, spiders. Ooh, that treasure, you know what? That treasure chest is not worth my time. I real actually, you know what? It could be worth my time. It could be worth my time, maybe a little bit. No! I turned it into a freaking gem. F. Okay, we got the minigun. No no uh, ra uh, aiming, though. That was sad. That was the saddest thing that's ever happened to me. Saddest thing that's ever happened to me. Totally. Okay, uh, we're a little over halfway there, but we don't have half fuel, so... <sighs> I don't know. This is, this is just a really hard map. Good finale map here, though. That's for sure. Okay, um, okay, yeah, bullets reflecting. Reflecting bullets seems, uh, really good. Okay, now we're going through this poison area. Nice. Let me get to this heart area. Turn them into gems, baby! So much money, dude. 144,000. We might be able to afford the more fuel after this. That's what I definitely want. Definitely what I want to save up. But I love just shooting both in front of me and behind me, especially with this minigun. And they all ricochet. Uh, yeah, with ricocheting, I think we want more bullet range. If I had to guess, one of the few times I really fully care about the, the range. Okay, we're making some progress. Making some progress. We're going down there faster now. We're getting more and more upgrades here. That's the beauty of getting all these gems beyond all of the out-of-game progression. We're getting there. We're getting there. We're getting close to empty, though. There's some chain reaction stuff. Love all that. I want to know the lore behind these swords. The lore behind the swords is the most uh, interesting part of the lore. Dude, I don't know if we're going to make it. I straight up don't know if we're going to make it. More bombs. The ricochet could be cool, but bombs are going to help me go down. Dude! I don't know! I don't know if we got time! We're running out of fuel! I gotta get really lucky with the placement of the uh, ch uh, treasure chest. Welcome, welcome, uh, Wing. Somebody else popping in here. I'm trying to make it down to the end before I run out of fuel. It's getting a little bit hard here. We are any moment now going to run out of fuel. I'm so close to the bottom where I need to be. But I don't know. There's a big treasure chest. I don't know. I, I'm not even going to focus on the treasure chest. Oh, okay. We got to go to the left. We got to go to the left. We're about to run out of fuel, though. Come on. Can I do it before we run out of fuel? Can I do it before we run out of fuel? Oh, God. Oh, God. I'm about to run out of fuel. I'm about to run out of fuel. Please, game. I wish there was a fuel one. I wish there was a fuel one. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. We're almost there. 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 Let's go! Just barely. Oh, let's do it. Let's go. 378,000. Whoo! What do we unlock? 
Petroglyph sonar. F sonar, find nearby fuel blocks. That's pretty good. And now we can increase the flight time. For the final flight time, it cost 1.5 million. Wow. Anything cost 105K? No? Okay. Woo, dude. So we have cleared this. There seems to be another uh, treasure, uh, whatever, uh, goblin ship flying up there. Oh, if we went out of bounds. I can't actually go get him. <laughs> so we've made a lot more progress. Let's go look at the vault to see what actual progress we're done with the game here before we end. We have made it up to... 62% complete with the game. Uh, and that's with us having 3.6 hours in the game. So, I mean, it definitely has got at least like 5 or 10 hours of gameplay of the story, right? And then with the daily modes, all of this other out-of-game progression stuff they're adding. But, uh, man... I love this game. I love that we unlocked the new drone character, or I guess the gem character, and then we unlocked all those drones and stuff like that. Uh, we made some progress. This game's just very, very fun to play. Uh, very, very fun casual game to play. So, um, you know, if you guys are watching after the fact on YouTube, uh, let me know if you want to see more. Uh, maybe it's a series we do every now and then. Up to you. Uh, let me know if you want to see more, you know, uh, but if there is more it'll be on the screen right next to me uh, uh, Check out the playlist for all the other, you know builds we've gotten in the past uh, And uh, yeah, if y'all are gonna be grinding out some boar blasters on your own Then I wish you guys luck and see you all next time